all around the world, we see natural disasters leave communities without safe running water. We're seeing it now in Louisiana in the aftermath of Hurricane Ida, and we saw it here during the winter freeze. But what if there was a way to get water right out of the moisture into the atmosphere? Well, as Max Massey shows us, that company exists and it's coming to Port San Antonio. To solve global water scarcity, in a sustainable manner. Neil Allen is an Air Force veteran and the COO of Genesis Systems, a company that says they can help so many people around the world thanks to biomimicry. Water evaporates and turns into clouds, condenses, uh, rains back down onto the earth and then is captured either in groundwater uh, or down in the aquifers. Uh, this is the hydraulic cycle. It may seem complicated because it is, but Alan breaks it down. Our process uh, basically strips the water uh, or the moisture out of the air. Uh, and as we go through the process, we are actually distilling uh, the water. And it is coming to Port San Antonio. We see the Port of San Antonio as an amazing place uh, for us to unveil this, uh, this technology that we believe will change the world. Uh, hopefully sooner than later. Genesis Systems can help so many people around the world. And while it's here in Port San Antonio, the idea is that it helps promote science and education. Well, we're not just bringing the technology here and showing it off. We are putting this in a park-like setting. The idea is to get local students and local schools involved. And we're going to have working with SAMSAT and working with the schools, our kids coming in, working on water resilience, sustainability, and environmental programs right next to the scientists who are doing the research on the technology. This is just part of the growth of the port, one of the hubs of technology and science in our area. Who knows, maybe those kids will develop the next technology that takes this to the next level. Max Massey, KSAT 12 News.